Hi, I'm Mike Beister from Brainetics. One of the ways I teach people to have fun practicing numbers and working with numbers and adding numbers is a trick where they have someone take a one digit number and double it a bunch of times, writing it down on a piece of paper and then adding up all the numbers that they doubled. And then they will read you the numbers that they doubled and you will add them up in your head. So say they take the number six. Six, and we'll continue, continuously double that number. Six plus 12 plus 24 plus 48 plus 96 plus 192 plus 384. You're gonna add up all those numbers in your head. The way you do it is you take the last number that was read, 384, and try to double that in your head. 384 doubled is 768. And then you subtract the first number that was read to you, 6. 768 minus 6 is 762. That is the sum of all those numbers that were read to you. It is an amazing trick. People will freak out when, when you do it to them. But it's also a fun way to practice working with numbers. Thanks. Okay, now we're going to multiply two numbers in the 90s together. Let's take 93, which is 7 away from 100. So we're going to put a little 7 next to 93, multiplied by 96, which is 4 away from 100. So we'll put a 4 next to the 96. You take the top number, 93, and you subtract the second number in parentheses. 93 minus 4 is 89. That is the first half of your answer. Then you multiply the two numbers in parentheses together. 7 times 4 is 28. So the answer to 93 times 96 is 8,928. How about we'll do one more? How about 98, which is 2 away from 100, times 97, which is 3 away from 100. Okay, remember you take the top number, 98, and you subtract the second number in parentheses. 98 minus 3 is 95. Next, you multiply the two numbers in parentheses together. 2 times 3 equals 6, but since it's less than 10, you got to put a zero in front of it. So it's zero, 06. So the answer to 98 times 97 is 9,506. Thanks. Hope to see you again soon. I'm going to teach you guys how to do is multiply two two digit numbers that end in one. Okay, here we go. Say we have a number like. Uh, 31 times 41. Okay, this is how it's going to work. Step one, multiply the 10 digits together. 3 times 4 is? 12. 12. Now add a 0 to that. What do you get? 120. Everyone got 120? 3 times 4 is 12. Add a 0 on the end, you have 120. Then, you add this number to it, 120 plus 3 is 123, plus 4 is 127, and then put a 1 on the end. 1, 2, 7, 1. Okay, understand? It's 12, add a 0 is 120, 120 plus 3 is 123, plus 4 is 127, add a 1. Wow. Okay, cool. Okay guys, the same skills you had for multiplication, you're going to use for adding. And adding will be a lot easier. I add and multiply the same way. Most people add from right to left, but I'm going to add from left to right. And i show you guys exactly how to do it. It's the same thing as you did before. We're going to have five three-digit numbers. Say 623 plus 451 plus 275 plus 328 and plus 831. Okay, you're going to start at the left-hand column. 
Who could tell me what the left-hand column adds up to? Kathy? 23. 23. 23 is the number in your head. Same exact thing as before. Add the middle comma. Who has an answer? Who has an answer? Who has an answer? Who has an answer? Let's go with Judy. I think it's like, I think I just lost it. Oh. Um, Twenty? No. Nineteen. 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 So you had twenty-three in your head. Twenty-three. The second number is nineteen. Add the tenth number in your head. Twenty-three plus one is twenty-four. Tack on a nine. Two, four, nine. You had twenty-three. Then you had nineteen. Two, four, nine. Last column. Andrew. Eighteen. Eighteen. Add the one to two forty-nine. Two fifty. Tack on the eight. 2508. Same exact way you did the multiplication, you're doing the adding.